So what's up, world? It's your girl Wally here at Maya's Treasure Box. And I'm finna finish this on up for my motherfucking fire signs. I don't did my Aries on up for my Sagittarius running ass on here. No, this message right here does not have a time stamp on it. So whenever you hear it, that's what it's meant for you to hear. We just finna freestyle this. I told y'all this. We gotta get them subscriptions up. We gonna hit that live. They ain't ready for us yet, y'all. They ain't ready to sit down and read jazz. My Sagittarius, check this out. Let yourself stand out and be noticed. Don't hide who you are. You are who you are. Don't be afraid of who you are listening. If you real, you real. If you a lover, to be a lover. You can do that in front of your boy. Let them clown. They clowning for what? I bet you they ass ain't happy. I'm just saying. Your girl, y'all know what I mean. Accept the situation as it is rather than fighting to change it. You Sometimes things you just got to let well enough be alone. But if it's something that you feel like you're in the wrong for, it should be rectified. I mean, it's self the however it is. You know what I'm saying? Charge it to the game as we do it. But it's time to start facing our feelings and emotions. That's the test. That's our biggest test, Sagittarius. Your ancestral spirit guys are offering you guidance now. So pay close attention to the signs and omens from the Ain't that some shit? And I just said that. Music is essential to your healing and well-being, whether singing, playing an instrument, or listening. Some of y'all can sing, dance, rap, right? Y'all are very creative. Music. Put that music on. That slow music. Jazz. Whatever. It soothes your soul. It does something to you. It does something to you. So let's see my Sagittarius. We just seeing what we got going on. We're going to freestyle this one. We ain't got no time frame. Wait a minute. I'm going to use this deck. Yeah, so I brought it. My Sagittarius. My Sagittarius. Y'all got somebody that y'all have a lot of love for. And I really feel like this is a love that's intuitively and divinely guided because I see temperance here. That's your all energy, y'all. So that's basically something to reconcile with something because somebody is not sleeping at night, whether if it's you or if it's them. I feel like the love is a mutual thing on both ends. But I feel like you're stuck, like you don't know what to do. They could have, listen, they could have the initials of the letter M. Y'all see that? Y'all see that? Yeah, initial M. But whoever this is, Sagittarius, I think that they ain't sleeping and you stuck. That's what I think it is. It could be another fire sign, Leo, Sagittarius, or Aries. Strong Leo here. Listen, when I tell you, you love this person just as much as they love you. And it's a lot of passion. And it's like, maybe sometimes y'all both... Um, Maybe both of y'all display that masculine energy. But this person loves you the same way that you love them. And they want you the same way you want them. Jess is kicking in because somehow this person probably this person is feeling like they tired of carrying the burden because you're not seeing their worth and who they are, what's right in front of you. To you, they'll wish in a dream come true. But in the past it could have been some deception. It could have been a lot of deception in the past, but it's something, whatever happened in the past, it caused you to realize it right now. This motherfucker shit. Aries, energy, whoever this is, they don't made you boss the hell up or you don't make them boss up. But it's nobody, it's no communication. When y'all do talk, because you want this brand new start, but it's like somebody is being an asshole when it comes to talking and they're going to start an argument because they don't want to just tell the fucking truth when... Y'all are intuitively connected, combined, um, divinely connected. You guys really can communicate without even being around one another. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Y'all just feel like... Y'all feel like this person finna walk away and leave. It could be a Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, and it's a strong Leo again. Y'all trying to go towards y'all person now because y'all, this maybe this person already left and you trying to get this person back and it's like you feel the rapture now. It takes some time to take a leave. This person ain't playing no more. They cutting through to the truth because they feel like you don't left them out in the cold so long and you feel like you got your heart broke. But I think a lot of if it, 
whoever side this resonate on didn't recognize that the other one was a soulmate. One did, one did. One did and one did. And then one of y'all, and it looked like y'all said, y'all let outsiders tell y'all things. That's not true. But it's just misery love company. When you put that together, then you'll realize the people that's be telling y'all that's uh-uh. Mm -hmm. Well, y'all need to realize something that I tell my cancers all the time. Yes, blood is thicker in water. But that motherfucker will leak the same way water do. Only if it's coagulated, meaning if it's clotted. It's still a fucking leak. Either way it go, that bitch can melt at any time. That shit is unpredictable. Anything solid can always go back to liquid before it goes into a ghastly form. I'm just saying. Your family, love, loyalty, your family is based upon loyalty. Okay? I write my Sagittarius, so there ain't no time frame on that, you know what I'm saying? Because I fuck with my fire sign. I appreciate y'all. So, y'all, you know, share the video, share the love, share the lie. Let me know. Let me know what y'all got going on. I don't know. It's kind of interesting. Let's, let's compare notes.